Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have my weekly entire house clean with me. If you're new here, I put these out every single week and it just motivates me to get my whole house cleaned at once and I hope that it motivates you to get your house clean, to do your to-do list, whatever is on your plate today. I hope this gives you the extra kick that you need. I wanted to let you guys know that this video is in collaboration with Lynette Yoder. She is a really good friend of mine and she recently had a new addition to her family. They live in Florida and she also has two little boys. She does a lot of similar content to me. She does home decor, cleaning motivation, family vlogs, and also DIY projects. She's actually been a really good close friend to me for the last year and um, has been with me through thick and thin and I just appreciate her so much and appreciate her friendship. So whenever you're done watching my video, definitely head on over to her channel, watch her cleaning video as well. It will be linked in the description box and let her know that I sent you. So the first thing I did was get the living room cleaned up. I don't really have a true routine whenever it comes to cleaning the whole house and normally I like to start in a different area than I did the last week just because I like to have a little bit of variety. Um, <laughs> so I went ahead and just kind of picked up the living room and dusted everything. I don't know about you guys, but I am definitely ready to decorate for spring. Um, whenever I took my Christmas decor down, I just kind of put up my more so normal decor, but I want to add in a few spring touches here and there, so I'll probably be doing a decorating video really soon. But it will get you no matter how far you go, it haunts you every night. I tried so hard to forget what we had, but then something reminds me of you. Do you remember the necklace you gave? Speaking of spring, I went ahead and lit this sugared petals candle from Aldi. If you have an Aldi near you, you need to check out their spring candles. They smell so good and they're only $3.99. I always like to grab at least one whenever the season changes.
So in this entire area, the stove, the counters next to it, the backsplash, the microwave, I've actually been loving the Method degreaser spray. I really think it does such a great job. It smells good and it just keeps the grime at bay that comes with the stove. Style. Sleeves rolled up, glasses on, and then you make that smile. My heart starts racing when I'm with you. Mm -hmm. You, when I'm with you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Can't get enough of this. Being with you is like never ending sunshine. Feels like everything stops for a while when we look into each other's eyes. During the week, I kind of spot clean this table and chairs. My daughters, they are two, three, and four, and they use this on a daily basis just to eat lunch and things like that. So I spot clean it during the week, but whenever cleaning day rolls around, I really try to wash it all up really well so that it doesn't get, you know, build up splatters on it and stuff that I can't, eventually can't get off. And I also made myself a cup of coffee in between all of this. I love having a cup of coffee kind of going along with me through the house while I'm cleaning. was on the phone with my mom for a minute while I was unloading the dishwasher. If you're curious where something might be from, it's more than likely from Amazon. I do a lot of shopping on Amazon and I do my best to link things in the description box that you might see in my video. So if you're looking for a link, you may be able to find it there. I had kind of taken a break from using my spin mop after we moved and I'm back to using it and really love it. The other mop that I use sometimes is a Norwex mop, but I just feel like that the spin mop really gets things extremely clean.
My parents had been visiting over the weekend and my mom got out a bunch of craft things with my girls and so I was just cleaning that all up. And this handy tablecloth is actually from the camping section at Target. It's kind of a little more heavy duty and something that we can reuse over and over. And I'm kind of excited to see if it lasts a few years. All of the paint splatters and things that will slowly get put on it and put a lot of memories into it. I actually want to write the date on it. I think it would be kind of fun to um, see how many years it holds up and see what all gets put on it. All right, so this was actually a separate day, and if you watch regularly, you know that a lot of times, at least in the last couple weeks, I've been doing my cleaning in two different days. So I kind of do the half of the house that has the living room, dining room, and kitchen the one time, and then the next time I will do the bedrooms and the bathrooms. It just kind of works a little bit better for me to divide it into two. So this is obviously the bedroom side of the house, and I went ahead and straightened up our room and vacuumed. Next, I moved into our bathroom, and I say this a lot, but this tub is the one that my daughters use to take baths, so I always make sure that I clean it really well. And then obviously the shower as well is something that we use all the time. We have a second bathroom, as you'll see, but we don't use the shower in there just because it's easier to have the girls in the bigger tub. Someone recently asked me if I use cleaners um, to clean and I do as you can see there was like the tub cleaner and then I use a bathroom cleaner um, but there are some places like the sinks that I actually use my Norwex cloths and if you don't know what those are they actually have colloidal silver in them and that is antibacterial so you don't use a cleaner with them in fact a cleaner can actually ruin them because it will recognize the cleaner as a bacteria and hang on to that, um, if that makes sense. If you're new to the fact of you've never heard of Norwex before, just Google it, um, search it on YouTube, you can see how it works. And I really like it for my mirrors and sinks. So maybe that's why the question came up, um, if I use a spray cleaner, because I do, um, but not with the Norwex cloths.
This is the second bathroom that I was talking about and it's really close to my daughter's bedrooms. So they use it a lot and I just quick whip through there. I only did my one daughter's room because it was almost nap time this day and I needed to get them all down. I do have the girls help me with the cleaning a lot so they can tackle the other part. And don't forget to check out Lynette's video. The link will be in the description box. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button, give this video a like, and I'll see you guys in my next video.